Saul Alvarez will defend his WBC middleweight title as he takes on Amir Khan on Saturday, May 7th at the T-Mobile Arena in Las Vegas, Nevada. This will be the biggest fight in the career of Khan who comes into this fight with a record of 31-3 while Alvarez is 46-1-1. Alvarez won the middleweight title last November when he defeated Miguel Cotto. Alvarez is listed almost as a 5-1 favorite to win this fight against Khan with the rounds listed at 9.5 under. Amir Khan with a record of 31-3 and 19 KOs. Khan will be moving up almost two weight divisions to face Alvarez at 155 pounds for the WBA middleweight title and he has revitalized his career after losing twice in an eight-month period as he was beating Lamont Peterson and Danny Garcia. Since those two losses, Khan has won his last five bouts although the level of competitions has been suspected. He realizes he can't make any mistakes against a fighter like Alvarez. It's been tough, obviously, working on these strategies with my trainer Virgil being more focused because I know that one little mistake in a fight like this could get me in trouble, said Khan. Going toe-to-toe -to -toe with Alvarez would seem like a big mistake, but that seems to be what Khan is planning. I'm not going to be thinking I'm stronger than Canelo, but I'm going to stand him and fight with him, Khan said. I think my skills in this fight will win me the fight. I don't think that Canelo experienced speed with combinations and speed with power. Saul Canelo Alvarez, 46-1-1, 32 KOs. The only loss in the career of Alvarez came to Floyd Mayweather Jr. in 2013. Since that defeat, Alvarez has won his last four fights against Alfredo Angulo, Eric Landy Lara, James Kirkland and Miguel Cotto. Alvarez is already being touted as the new number one in boxing. I don't want to answer the question, Alvarez said. It's not up to me, it's up to the people out there. My job is to train hard, go fight and do my best. The people decide who's number one, the best in boxing, Alvarez said, and he's completely ready to take on at 155 pound weight. I'm going to take advantage of every opportunity I've got and win that fight, Alvarez said. I'm a totally different fighter from three years ago. More experienced, smarter, stronger. It's two different fighters from back to then now. If Alvarez wins as expected and Gennady Golovkin wins against Dominic Wade, then it could be Alvarez against Golovkin meeting later this year. Eventually that fight is going to happen, no doubt about it, but we focus on May 7th and Amir Khan. Golden Boy CEO Oscar de la Hoya said.